Hello there, my name is Carson Mullet and I'm the sales manager here at Swiss Valley Furniture. Today, I wanna to show you how to self-store leaves inside a table. This table here is 42 by 66 with two self-storing leaves. We have three standard types of slides for our tables. The first is wood slides that we typically put on our leg tables. The second is metal gears that typically go on our pedestal and trestle tables. Our third is a self-equalizing ball bearing slide that we can put on both the leg tables and the trestle tables. The first thing you want to do is pull the table apart. If you have a leg table, you're going to want two people, one on each end, or if you have a trestle or a pedestal, you can do it by yourself. Simply grab it by the end and pull it apart evenly and together. Just like that. Make sure you pull it all the way apart so you can easily access the inside. Inside, you take out the leaves, and if you look on the end, there will be a little number, one, two, three, or four, depending how many leaves you have. That will tell you the order to put them in. On the inside of the table top, you'll also find the number where to start. So there's the zero, so we know exactly which order these fit in. Carefully put them in, put the pins into the holes. Once all your leaves are in, or however many you want, push it together until it's tight. Now you're ready to be the perfect host. But after everyone's gone home and you want to break it down and go smaller again, you simply do the same steps in reverse. Pull it apart, making sure you're all the way extended, that way you can safely put your leaves inside. Each leaf is 12 inches. Now you can also self-store up to four leaves on a table that's 42 or 48 wide. The first two go in just like a normal table, pin to pin with the aprons facing down. Then there's two more leaves that do not have an apron skirting, which allows the tabletop to close. You carefully put them in face to face or top to top. And that is how you self-store four leaves inside a table. And just push the table together again. There you have it, you're all set. 